Hello friends and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to show you where to find your vector scope in DaVinci Resolve, especially if you just upgraded to the new DaVinci Resolve 19. Let me show you where you find it. So I am in DaVinci Resolve right now. So this is my clip over here. And let me show you where to find the waveform. So if I go now to the color page in DaVinci Resolve, no matter what are my project settings, I'm gonna go quickly to project settings. And if I go to color management here, you can see I'm in DaVinci YRGB, but no matter the color management that I have, I cannot find the waveform, you see? Nothing is shown here. So it doesn't matter in which node I am even if it's saturation, contrast, balance, and exposure, it doesn't show, but actually it's a quick fix. Let me show a way to find it. So basically, if you are here, if I go to Parade, if I go to Waveform, if I go to Vectorscope, you see the Vectorscope is showing here clearly. If I go to Histogram, Histogram is fine. And <laughs> it's actually pretty simple. So if you go here to the settings over here and you click on it, you will see now you are in RGB, Okay, and then you have a few more settings here, and these settings are showing here very, very well. But if you go to RGB, nothing is showing, okay? And you know why? It's because the RGB, it's not toggled on. What you have to do is simply press on each one. Red, green, blue, boom. And now the problem is fixed. And if you go to this ones over here, you can see that now it shows the red, green, and blue. I don't know, for some reason in DaVinci Resolve 19, it doesn't show. And I was shocked. I was like, what is going on? Why it doesn't show? So I actually found this accidentally when going to my um, vector scope over here. And I went to settings just to get my my line here to get the, the skin the skin tone line indicator. You can put it on and off. And and I thought, well, let me go to waveform and go to the settings over here. And I just accidentally saw this red, green, blue. And I thought, well, this is RGB, right? So I accidentally clicked on it and it just shows me here. So, you know, uh, well, anyway, I'm sure if I would have went into the manual and read everything, the somewhere it should be, if you wanna see just the red channel, then you press red and green and blue, you leave it off just to see where that color sits, which is quite genius. But anyway, I wanna see them all at the same time. But yeah, again, if I wanted to have just the red channel, I'm toggle this on. If I wanna have just the green channel, here it is. If I have only the blue channel, then here it is. If you want to have them all together, just press them all together and this is it. And that's all friends. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it interesting and useful and you got some value out of it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Happy creation. Bye-bye.